Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Yes, it's Monday again. Merry Monday to you. I've decided not to say Happy Monday anymore because if you say something is merry, that makes it happier, right? <laughs> yes, it is Monday. Once again, I uh, not a lot of happy things I can say about it, but I have been starting to see the leaves are turning, they're falling. It's looking awfully spooky month out there. What else I love to bits are all you positive people out there who watch these videos on Monday, and you're doing it so you can try to get Monday out of the way. You know, you wanna laugh at Monday. You wanna start off your week with some laughter and some funny things and a smile on your face because you wanna pick yourself up, get through that Monday. Oop, Monday dance. We gotta go through Monday. I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn Monday into a metal song one day, and it's gonna, sound horrible but i really appreciate you guys for like being here with me on monday and sharing it with me for for all that it is aggressive princess says raccoons can tear up a house pretty easily plus i think it's illegal to own one in most states without some sort of certification that being said i don't care and the next time a raccoon breaks into my house i'm gonna pamper that fuzzy boy see that's the kind of positivity i'm talking about and by the way that's also what my mother did my mother lives in arkansas there are raccoons all over the place and they do not mind coming right up to your house she my mom loves animals she just let them in they just one of they just one of them walked in is like all right my place now too and there were people that was like oh wait you can't do that you can't legally own a raccoon she's like own Bitch just moved in. I didn't even ask it to. Just, I got a new roommate now. It just happens to be a raccoon. She got away with it too. <laughs> she, and she kept it for a long time until uh, it actually had babies and they were running around the house. And then finally she scooped them all up and dropped them out in the woods. But if you think that's crazy, then let's take a look at your world. Uh, it's, uh... Ooh. Whoa! How? What? What food explodes? I'm trying to think of the food that explodes. I, I'm, I've never walked into a grocery store and found the weapons grade aisle. Were those tomatoes? Do they have explosive tomatoes? That would be kind of handy, actually, because, you know, you'd be making dinner and maybe somebody breaks in and be like, tomato! <laughs> Boom! I have no idea what that food was, but I'm thinking if it's exploding, then you, maybe you shouldn't eat it. Oops. <laughs> Haley, that's not funny. Haley, what are you done? Oh my God. Haley, Bobby. what did you do, Haley? See, Haley, here's the deal. It, that That's just plain Monday. You weren't being stupid. You just lifted a thing and, and Monday went, oh, I can mess this up. <laughs> so unfortunately, Monday came down and slapped you right across the tits and made you do something that you normally wouldn't have done. If this was Tuesday, that wouldn't have happened. It's Monday. Monday does this. It's, it's, it's a habit. Whoa. Ooh. <laughs> hey, I, you know what? I told you guys, I already told you, the trees are coming to get us. Of course, normally when the trees are coming to get us, they're just coming to take over the planet because trees hate humans for some reason. But that, that one, I kind of give that tree a bit of an excuse because the guy was shooting it. If I was a tree and somebody was just shooting me over and over again, eventually I'd go, okay, where is your face? So don't shoot trees. Well, at least not until they really start invading. Then we can shoot them all we want. Oh, oh dear. Yikes. Okay, and just, no, I just went, okay, yeah. All right, that, you know, I know there's gonna be a lot of animal people out there that's gonna, oh, the snake was confused by the color of the shirt and perhaps it was in the direction of the, that, as a snake owner and all the other snake owners, they'll say, no, he probably just didn't like that guy. Snakes are just like any other animals. They're like dogs, they're like cats. And I think that snake probably just went, you know what? Fuck that particular dude. They can do that. You can hand a snake to like a hundred people and they'll just wrap around and play. But one person, they'll be like, I don't like that person. Don't know why. Honestly though, snake lesson is that that was a big snake. There were like four people holding that snake 
and it's, it bit a guy, but all you got out of that guy was like, oh, it, guy's not gonna die, he's fine. He's, even a snake that large is really not gonna hurt you, so. Mommy needs medication to <laughs> Uh, I, I don't know. Ooh. I don't know why that's not a real book. It should be. Daddy, why does mommy drink so much? Go look in a mirror, kid. <laughs> I mean, hey, it's um, it's it's mean to just throw it out there, but it it's not completely untrue, you know. Nice car. Ooh. <laughs> That's me. That's gonna be. That's gonna. That is gonna be me. That is 100% gonna be me. And you know what? I don't care. I'll get a car like that anyway, and I'll crawl out of it every time. I. I just. I don't care anymore. If I have to crawl around and look like an idiot, that's fine. But if I could afford a car like that, hell yeah, I'd take one. Uh-oh, 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 uh -oh. Goodbye, Christmas. See, I, now that, that's the thing. I don't, why do they do that? Cat people, let's, let's have a little discussion right here. It's not so much that cats destroy everything possible, but it's that little dance they do at the end where they're like, wait, what? Oh, we didn't mean to do that, did we? We had no idea. No, you knew. They freak out after they bust something like, we had no idea that would happen. It's, it's a lie. They knew it, and they're just trying to get away with it. You know about those cats? Both of them ran back in the back room after they went, wait, what? No. And they went back there, and they're like, all right, all right, man, right. Oh, nailed it. Christmas is dead. Cats are heathens. Something's loud. I... What? Hello, I know nothing about cars. Can someone please explain to me how a car can rev its engine so hard that its back tires fall off? That doesn't make sense to me. I mean, I, re I, <laughs> I literally don't know why that happened. I'm guessing that it's probably because Somebody was like, had too big of an engine and was trying to go too fast in too short a time. I don't know if that's it or not, but. Could be. Are you just stealing that or what? Go, 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 go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my God. Dude just almost folded himself over. Those are the cruelest, like, fences, right? Fences, if that's what you can call them. Are those chains? Because you you forget, you don't actually see those a lot of times. You just walk right into them. Those are, those are kind of mean, aren't they? They're kind of funny, too, sometimes. I entered 10 puns into a contest to see which one would win. No pun intended. <sighs> Welcome to my pain. Welcome to the pain of Monday. Welcome to it. It will never go away. It'll never stop. You're like, well, if I just get through it a little bit, then it'll go away. No, it won't. It'll be like this every Monday until you die. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I, I don't... I don't know exactly if that was a, a little practical joke or what, but... I know if the last thing you see is a bus running over your shoe, the universe just gave you the finger. That's the whole universe saying, guess what I'm gonna add to your day, bus. So you might as well just, look, just after that happens, just pack up and go home and go back to bed. It's not gonna get any better. Oh, 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 whoa, oh, whoa, oh, 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 oh. well, hey, hey, not the, uh. <laughs> Oh no, that, that first one got me and now I can't stop. Oh, oh I've been there. I've been to that. I've been, to, I've been in that condition before. You're not drunk enough to pass out, but you are so drunk that you have no sense of direction. You have no dignity and you, you don't, you just don't care. So you just let gravity 
pull you wherever it takes you. And even when she hit the glass, she just she didn't, she didn't even care. She just fell down. She's like, oh well. <laughs> oh boy, I'll tell you, when she wakes up in the morning, though, she's gonna change her mind. <laughs> This one's gonna kill me today. Okay, this oh, this show's gonna kill me today. I, oh my god, I have never seen a bed eat so much. I have never seen a bed just go oh no, um, and to just eat a whole human being before. That's I don't know if I should be laughing. I I, I maybe should be terrified. I can't figure it out. Monday's going to get you. Okay, wait, wait a minute. We uh, we just saw Monday in action right now. And I, it's almost supernatural. Because if you watch this, they flipped it out. It was perfect. And Monday went, oh, no. No, we can't have that. We got to screw this up, even though they did it perfectly. If you watch, nothing happens. She doesn't trip. She doesn't fall. Nothing bumps into her. The plate literally flips out of her hand. Almost like something else tipped it. Watch. Look. I swear to God, it just flips out. Bloop. What did that? What did it? I'll tell you what did it. Monday. You guys, you don't believe me. I know you don't. You think I'm making this up. Monday literally took that right in front, right on camera, and just flipped it right out of her hands. You guys will believe me eventually. I swear you will. Oh. oh. <laughs> oh no. The mistake was when you're when you're gonna chop through something, <laughs> you kinda need to hold on to the sword. That that would be helpful. However, he recovered from it because he had the best response ever. <laughs> Oops. Oh, you know, sometimes, sometimes that's the, that's the most graceful thing you can do. Oops. <laughs> I need to say that more often, don't I? I really do. Falling off a roof when you're a kid. Sneezing too hard when you're an adult. You know, I hear, I, I hear some of y'all younger kids out there. You're younger and you're laughing. You may be in your teens, your twenties, and you're laughing at this. Go ahead. Keep laughing. You laugh about it all you want to. I swear to God, it will happen to you. This is not a lie. I'm not, this is, this is reality. People are always saying, you know, you're only as old as you feel. Sure, you may feel like you're, you know, 21 years old, but if your spine feels like it's 60, it's gonna break anyway. But I, you know what? I'm not gonna say don't laugh at it. Keep laughing. I mean, seriously, laugh at it. Laugh at it now while you can, because later, you ain't gonna be laughing no more, I promise. So take the opportunity. Ah! Oh, <laughs> okay. Oh uh, well, you know, I actually kind of like to see those. And it's not like I like seeing people get punched or anything, but people either they have fight or flight. And what we're assuming is that they're gonna have flight but that ain't always true. If you have like a friend who was like trained in the military or as a police officer or trained in any kind of combat, like fighting or any other kind of fighting, and you jump out and you scare them, that's probably what's gonna happen sometimes. They're just gonna turn around and knock you down before they even realize what they did. So, I don't know, maybe these, the scare things, maybe that's not the best thing to do all the time. Just ask the guy that got knocked down. He'll probably agree with me. Just right in the middle of the crosswalk. Yeah, yes! Yes! I, yeah, I, I've been dreaming for that! I've been asking for that! Oh my god! That's, I, I, I swear, I asked for that on this show! I don't know how many episodes it was back, but I said, I, I said I wish when people pull onto the crosswalk that people would just walk over the car. That, how many people are watching this show? I'm getting a little scared now. <laughs> Oh, what it? <laughs> okay, that wasn't... 
That didn't have to be Monday. That was just your dumbass. That Monday didn't have anything to do. That could have happened on Wednesday. That was just somebody being really, really dumb. We need camels. We need more camels. Why do we need camels? Because if you can stand a camel in front of something like that, and they look at it and go, fuck no, I ain't going over there, then don't drive your car over it. I think camels do have a certain wisdom. We ought to pay attention to it. It's not going to work. I don't know why people still... <laughs> he, he didn't even get one. Sometimes at least they'll get a few of them. They'll be like, okay, hey, it's working. Hey, boom, that that guy just like plug. Now it just they, they don't work. I don't I don't know why anybody would have thought those things would have worked in the first place. Uh. Well, now I'm just confused. I mean, Monday videos, they, they, they either make me laugh or they make me sometimes a little irritated or, but uh, I've never been confused by one. Who was that guy? I mean, was that just a random dude that just like floated out of the night and landed on a porch? I, I don't know. I hope that don't happen to me. I just start kicking it. I, <laughs> I'd probably get taken to jail later, but I, I I wouldn't be able to help it. Ever notice when the geese fly in a V formation, one side is always longer than the other? This is because there are more geese on that side. <laughs> I can't do the show anymore. I can't. God, stop. I can't. I can't do it. I, I just I, I I throw in these little these memes because I, I I thought they'd be a little good distraction. I didn't think anyone would ever actually make me laugh like that. Why is that funny? Because it's true. <laughs> Let that be proof that just the balls obvious can actually be funny sometimes because it that. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be okay with that when that happens to me. When you're a kid, you're young, your pants fall down and you get all embarrassed. Oh, girl, pull them up. You know, it, older people, we don't care. I can't wait till I get to an age where my pants fall down and I'm just gonna stand there. But yep, there it is. Look at the old moon smiling. So yeah, there is an age that uh, you don't care if your pants drop. And there's another thing that I don't care if it drops. And that is patreon.com slash Randy Griffin. If you guys enjoy these videos, and you notice that I'm actually, I do put effort into it, and I really love doing this. I, you know, support me a little bit. It might make you feel a little better. It'll definitely make me feel a little better. And I, I don't ask for a lot, just a few bucks here and there. I mean, if you want to give me a lot, I'm not going to say no. But if you give me a few bucks a month, then you get little extra perks and little extra things, and, and uh, I'll hang out with you. I mean, I literally do hang out with, like, most of my patrons if they want to be hung out with. So if you do have a few bucks laying around, and you don't have nothing to do with it, Send them to me, I'd really appreciate it. What is this design? Go ahead. <laughs> what the? Uh, okay, um, maybe. I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna guess. I've never seen one of those in the United States before. But what it looks like is it looks like some crap that you'd find in Europe that us dumb Americans have no idea what the hell it is. So if anybody knows what that is, if that's like something that you see wherever you live and you know what that is, I would like to know. Please explain it and, and you will clear up the mystery in my noggin and I, I will be thankful. <laughs> oh, she, oh, it's a, must, a reflective glass. Oh, she, she's taking sexy pictures. See, it's not just me. It's not just me. Guys don't understand this. It's, it, it is not just the eye. I don't know if there's some greater moral purpose in standing in front of a mirror and taking pictures of yourself looking sexy. I don't know if there is. There could be. I'm not saying there's a right and there's a wrong. What I am saying is that guys do not understand that including me. I don't understand why women take pictures of themselves all the time and pictures of food. And they, they just always, they, they gather around pictures of the food, pictures of me, and they ignore everything else. And I'm not saying that that's wrong or that it's hurting anybody, but it makes me sit there and go, why the fuck are they doing? <laughs>
I don't get it. But thankfully, something I do get is that now we're on our way to the weekend. We've gotten through Monday. This is Monday coming up. Build up all your motivation. Build up all your focus. Look directly forward and do this and go forward and just get through the Monday. And then we'll be on the way to the weekend. Hey, it happened last week, right? I was right about it. It's going to happen again. Trust me, I'm with you guys. I'm going to be going through this week too. So it's not just you. It's me too. If you ever want to send me a message sometime and say, hey, we got through Monday, I'm going to send you a thumbs up because we're going to do it. We're going to do it again. We're going to get through Monday. That was a look at your world and... <laughs> I don't know if I've ever seen so many videos like at once that made me laugh that much. This this may have been, I don't know if it was the funniest for you guys, but it was the funniest one for me. I would like to get one of these every now and then. I feel better now. I feel really better. Laughing makes you feel better. And it's one of the reasons I do this show is because maybe if you can start this up in the morning with your coffee and your bagel and have a few laughs then that'll make you feel better for monday and we know once you're done with monday you're on your way to the weekend so guys there it is another monday for you and i will see you again very soon